Let's open it up. Ooh, fancy. What's up team, welcome back to the Squishy Joshy channel. Today I look like a mess, but that's okay because we've got something very important that I had to make a video for. Boy am I excited about this. This is a brand new guitar everybody. Let me just pop over there and grab it. <coughs> Big shout out to Mike Ball from Mike and Mike's Guitar Bar over in the US of A. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be able to get a discount on the guitar, um, which was very much needed, especially after the Australian government or whoever wanted an extra additional $700 on the duty tax or whatever it is, I don't know, it's all this mumbo jumbo, forcing me to basically pay an extra amount of money on top of the guitar, which was already expensive, but I, I was just absolutely so thankful that Mike was able to give me a discount on this guitar. So let's go ahead and open this box. All right, here we go. Let's open this thing up. Hope you don't mind the mess, guys. Sorry, this is what I've got to work with. <laughs> so let's just get Cut this open right here. Ooh. So exciting. Just a bit of context. I have electric guitars already, but what makes this different to those ones is it's a 12 string guitar and it's made by a US, I think it's a US company called Rickenbacker. You may know bands like the Beatles, many of the old 60s bands and stuff like that they were very famous for playing guitars like this especially because of their very clear and crisp sound so that's another reason why i got it and also because it's it's a rare well not not exactly rare it's just a 2000s model but the cool thing about it is it's in my brand color you know the lovely teal okay so we've got a lot of bubble wrap we packaged it very nicely. Here we go. The last time I bought a guitar was the Fender 2018 Jazz Master Professional, I think. So, yeah, that was in teal as well. Now, you may be wondering why the guitars? Well, to answer that question, I have my own music project called Awkward Convo, so you can go check that out via the link up here. I, I'm guessing it's going to be up there or in the description. So I make original music there. I'm looking to do some covers at some point. Yeah, I've always been into music, so cool. Love, love it. Comes in a hard case. Great. Here we go, everyone. The moment of truth. Love it. Got the Rick and Backer. I don't know if you can see that. Rick and Backer case. Let's open it up. Ooh, fancy. Pog. Check this out, guys. I don't know if you can see it, but let me turn it around. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now that looks amazing. Mike and Mike's guitar bar wow well, wow well, <laughs> i don't know if i even want to touch it but i really do want to play it <laughs> it's the first time i'm actually going to play a 12 string which is crazy just look at look at i love the love the teal i mean that is my brand color oh it feels so ooh, pre premium oh it's nice and lightweight too see that's the other thing i really want to that's the other thing. I really wanted a, uh, I don't know if you can see me, but I really wanted a lighter weight guitar, which is brilliant because my Fender Jazzmaster, quite on the heavy side, but this one is slightly lighter, which I really like. Whoa. Can you, are you seeing this? Look at that. 12 string goodness. So I'm just, I'm just peeling these parts off now. Ooh. I don't know if it's in tune. But we'll soon find out. Check that out, guys. Rick and Becker, made in the USA. I spent some time trying to tune this up now, and we'll come back to it. So, I was recording my audio for the past 11 minutes, and the video wasn't recording. Okay, so we're going to just quickly skim through what I was talking about. I managed to tune it up. It is sounding awesome. I really love it. Um, I can play these kinds of... See that layered sort of double 
string sound. So there's 12 strings, so each string has a second string, if that makes sense. So it's like two E's, two A's, two D's, and so forth. So yeah, it's got that real jangle, jangly sort of feel to it. I really like it. Love the color, love the finish. Yeah, what do you guys think? I like it. Probably a bit pricey. It probably won't do something like that again for a long time. So yeah, hopefully this guitar will be with me for the rest of my life. Yeah. Hotel California sounds a lot more rich on a 12 string. So I'm going to spend some more time with this. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. This is a bit of a different video to what I'm usually making on this channel, but I thought, you know, because it's something a bit more special, uh, something that I really, really wanted for a long time. Um, yeah, I thought I'd make a, thought I'd make a quick sort of unboxing video and test of it. So before I wrap up this video, um, I'm going to be playing an original song of my upcoming release, which hopefully will be out in June, um, and it's called Dust. Ooh. I don't know.